Yo Geeks, Digi Sedger here, coming to you with more Pokemon Full White Nuzlocke. Alright, so today, I am going to go to the Dream Yard and then we will go from there. Sorry, my mouse cursor is on the screen. Alright, so, we're just going to get it started, we're just going to go right into it. That's all, I just, I've kind of realized that a lot of people that do watch these videos kind of just leave immediately after I start. Or not immediately after I start, but... They leave after like maybe two, two and a half minutes, something like that, you know. You, <clears throat> oh, I gotta think of him. I gotta think of like a really bad voice for Bianca. Um, let's see, what kind of voice could I give her? Hi, Dev. Are you looking for the mysterious Pokemon too? I don't know why I gave her some sort of like old lady smoker kind of voice. Well, that's the voice she's got now. Hey, did you hear a sound coming from the other side of that wall? Come on, let's go see. Alright. Hey, it's a moon up. Oh, wait. Wait, sweetie, don't leave. We found you, Muna. Come on, come on, make some dream mist. So interesting how you see like I don't remember what the first game was that actually showed like animations of like trainers hitting Pokemon with I know you get to see it here. Who are you? What are you doing? Are you talking about us? We're Team Plasma. We battle day and night to liberate Pokemon from foolish humans. What are we doing? The Pokemon Muna and Mushard I emit a mysterious vapor called Dreamist, which shows people's dreams. We're going to use that to make people want to release their Pokemon. We'll show them dreams to manipulate their hearts. Oh god. Man, he got a wind up for that one. He just, he walked back a few feet. <laughs> Probably kicked it, but whatever. Come on, spit out that Dreamist. You're kicking a Pokemon to make... Ah, god, that was Chara's voice. <clears throat> oh god, I already forgot the voice. Um. You're kicking a Pokemon to make a give off Dream Mist. That's me. Why? You're traitors too, right? That's right. We're Pokemon traitors too, but we're fighting for a different reason. I, I realize that that's a female grunt for those wondering if I actually realize that and I'm still giving it the same voice. Yeah, I realize. I don't care. They're all getting this. All the grunts are getting the same voice because they're all grunts. Unlike you two, we're fighting for the freedom of Pokemon. And suddenly po and setting Pokemon free means that we win Pokemon battles and take Pokemon by force. I'm not even gonna begin to discuss how flawed that is. So on that note, you will, we are going to rescue your Pokemon from you. What? Don't hurt Dev! Nah, I'll be fine, Bianca, don't worry. Don't worry, I'm kind of a... I'm kind of the player character here, I'll be fine. Famous last words. Okay. So Eli is out first. I think Eli's level 15? Oh, he's still 14. Okay, so he's on par with this. Alright. Just flame burst it. Oh god, acid spray. Eh... Uh, Okay. I know they do a lot now, but it might do a lot in a bit. Okay, so, whatever. Toxic spikes. That's actually really bad. Huh. So we better hope Eli can kind of just sweep this, sweep this dude's whole team. Alright, Eli does get a level up off of it. Uh, for those that are wondering when Eli will evolve, he evolves, um... By a firestone. So, we're gonna have to wait till we get a firestone. Drowsy Bean, especially tanky. Ah, it's got hypnosis. And Gen 5 sleep mechanics are garbage. Or. Is it Gen 5 sleep mechanics that are garbage? I don't remember. We have potions, so if we need to use them, we can. Oh! Oh my goodness.
This ain't good. If he does that much damage to us again, probably swap out. Why does yours have Zen Head, bud? Oh my god! Our first death of the playthrough. Our first death of the playthrough. This grunt does not know the fury I am about to unleash! <laughs> I'm actually mad! I did not want a death this early on in the playthrough. We still have more battles to go to! Oh my god, of course you have intimidate. That would have done way more. Alright, well. We lost one. It sucks. But, whatever. Eli got us past the... Eli got us past the first gym. But now I have no idea what I'm going to do for the third gym. I just have to hope I get like some sort of rock type or something. Please, heal me before the next battle. Were you not taking them seriously because they're kids? Well, whatever. I'm next. Alright. Alright. Fucking crits, dude. I hate them. I hate them so much. I hate how you all have poison types. And I don't get it. Even if I got healed, I would have had to swip, swap out Eli, because... Okay, I'm gonna get Gabe out of here. I... I just... I feel like I should. I'm gonna get Gabe out of here, we're gonna go into Austin. Wait! I have a Drowsy, why aren't I just using that? Whatever. It's just spamming smokescreen. Alright, look. I'm not dealing with my bad RNG right now. No, we're swapping out to Drowsy. Fuck this thing. I'm a little salty, if you can't tell. Just because of losing Eli to a critical hit. That was complete and utter bullshit. And now, we're, now our Drowsy's poisoned. My luck today is just not good. Like, I don't think that's gonna one try. Yeah, but it got close. And it's because we're a little un it's because Drowsy's a little under level. Seriously, I hate my RNG today. Watch, Drowsy's gonna miss this first confusion. Never mind. It's not the first, it's the second. Okay, level 17. Grimer. Okay. We'll stay in on Drowsy. Hopefully Drowsy doesn't get critted. Oh my god, forgot. Uh... These grunts are actually messing me up with all this poison, fucking accuracy lowers and shit like that. Oh my god, that's gonna lower my accuracy! Stop, please! Please, tackle. No! I'm gonna punch something. I really am! I hate this game right now! Ugh. Great. Now we're gonna lower my accuracy by two stages. That didn't kill? Why didn't that kill? 
Please, Austin, hit this water gun. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh man. God. This is not going well for us right now. We are getting kind of destroyed. Cacnea. Well, our only fire type's dead. I have to swap up the game. I don't want to keep Austin in on this. Okay, so Cacnea is just a grass type, so Bite is not going to get resisted. can't risk losing Gabe because Gabe is just our strongest Pokemon right now. Cacnea is basically back up to full because I had to... That almost didn't even matter. I almost lost all the HP that I healed. There we go. Made a flinch. Okay. Can't risk it. I can't risk like hoping for a flinch and then dying. Growth. Oh jeez. Not exactly good for us. Okay. I don't know what I want to do. Okay. Please let this pike kill. Yes. Okay. We're okay. We're alright. We're good. God. I can't believe in laws. But we have to obtain the Dream Mist. Go on, make with the Dream Mist. Knock it off! What are you two doing goofing off? We, Team Plasma, shall separate Pokemon from foolish people. If you can now fulfill your duties. But this is a gets us when he is gathering followers or gets us when he is trying to control people by tricking them with speeches. Yeah. This is get this gets us when a plan has failed and he is about to issue punishment. At any rate, let's hurry and say we're sorry so he forgives us. Yeah. Well, what was that just now? That person called Getsis appeared all over the place, and it wasn't real, right? Could it have been a dream? And that Pokemon? Oh! I couldn't wait, so I came over. Is that Musharna? Did something happen? Oh, Fennel. Well, you see, Muna was here. A Team Plasma and Muna. And Musharna came, and it showed us something like a dream. And then Team Plasma. I think I followed that. See, Musharna evolves from Muna. So, seeing Muna in trouble, it used its power making dreams into reality to save Muna. Which means, wait a second. Is this Dream Mist? With this, I can complete my research. You two come to my house later, okay? Phew, how random was that? Deb, why don't you go to Fennel's house? Me? Well, I'm going to go look for the new Pokemon we just saw now. Yeah, let me just go. I didn't think there'd be a death this early on in the playthrough. Still haven't done any training for Jess or Drowsy. But we have to, uh, we have to do it. We have to, to deposit Eli. Box A will be the dead box. I just realized we also have Prankster on our burn line. Nice. Oh my god, Herdier just got scrappy. Damn. Alright. Well, it's. It's best to just move on. No use, like, griping about it, so... It is what it is. It happens. Crits happen and stuff, so... I just have to keep moving on and... 
keep a positive attitude about the playthrough, you know? We'll get through this. I don't know how we may lose a lot of Pokemon along the way, but we'll get through it. Uh, okay, I guess I gotta go to Fennel's house, because I'm sure there's some plot wall that's gonna stop me. I don't even remember where her house is. Is it up here? No. I think it's the one over. Please tell me it's this one. I think it is this one. Yeah, it is. Alright. Ta-da! Thanks to you, I got some Dream Mist, and now I can collect save files of various trainers. Thank you very much. As a token of my appreciation, I will give you this Sea Gear to use. The Sea Gear is a device related to communications such as infrared connection or Nintendo Wi-Fi connection. Not that I'll be able to use that, but, eh, well, you know, it's part of the game. The Sea Gear. I don't know why I turned it on. I was just spamming my A button and it just... You see, the C's gear was activated and that showed up on the screen. If you touch the question mark icon at the bottom right of the screen, you can read about the C gear. About GameSync, I'd like to explain a little more about the system to collect trainer's save files. Do you have time to learn about more? No. I'm sorry, I'm so happy, so I will explain about it. Because thanks to you, we can do a great thing. Now Game Sync, oh my god, can retrieve memories of sleeping Pokemon using Dream Mist. That's right, we can collect save files of trainers from all over the world. What's more, we learned that if we use Game Sync to make Pokemon sleep, it will have dreams. Then, when you wake up with that Pokemon, it's, uh, it's dream it becomes a reality in a space called uh, Entralink in the middle of the Unova region. Isn't Game Sync interesting? If you like, please send your save file. I have some of the details in the PC, so please check... Check it if you have a chance. Oh, trainer, thank you very much for helping Fennel. This is from me. Please take it. Don't be shy. The Pal Pad. You can register your friends in your Pal Pad. After you register, you can link with those friends over and enter Wi-Fi connection to do all kinds of fun things. You can trade Pokemon, challenge your friends, do a battle, and so on. Let me give you a quick how-to on registering your friends. You can either input your friend's code directly by using your palpet, or you can use the IRL. Uh, the IR connection feature of the C gear. Then you can register your friend. Can I please go now? Thank you. Man, looking at the C gear really brings me back. I remember like during while also using the C gear. I mean, like, you could do, I believe, stuff like this. It's not changing for some reason. Okay, well, whatever. You could, like, change the shapes of those colors. Or, not colors. You could change, like, the shapes. You to, yeah, you have to do this. Okay, it's this you have to hit. Yeah. So, I mean, like, we'll just go with stars, because why not? Stars are great. But, yeah kind of nostalgic because I remember using that like all the time for my friends and stuff back when like uh, online was still supported for these games I don't think they're supported anymore which it's kind of sad but it is what it is correct you can correct me if I'm wrong in the comments in fact I'd rather you did okay Okay, we're gonna try and get Austin to evolve today. That way we can kind of make up for the loss of Eli. It kind of sucks, but it is what it is. What are you gonna do? Um, I know there's an, yeah, there's an item over here. It's a great ball. Sorry, my nose is just itchy. Okay, fire my this video, apologies. All right, well. I'm gonna be real, I'm not really feeling like a longer kind of episode. Feeling kind of a little extra tired today, and after that, you know, I kind of just. You know. Okay, so this is the daycare. And the house next door is the, um. Is the. Gosh dang. Kindergarten playhouse thing. And this is also where we can heal, so. I didn't need to heal there, but I just want to show you guys that this lady directly in front will heal you. Oh man. 
after this, I am gonna just relax before I go to work. Okay, so there's like five trainers here? I don't remember how many trainers exactly there are, but there, I think there's like five. Oh my goodness, why do you have four Pokemon? Uh, they're all like level 14. Okay, we're just gonna go with this water gun. Stab. Metronome. No, 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 no. Grab me. Oh. 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 Please, I'm tired of my RNG today. I need to kill this Togepi. Ha! Ah. Vital Spirit. Got him. Nice. Okay. Goodness gracious. Okay, one of her Pokemon down. Muna. We're gonna swap Pokemon. I just wanna kill these things. I just wanna kill the Pokemon as quickly as possible. But I mean, Gabe as bite, and that's just obviously gonna be super effective. So, we want that. Imprison. I never knew what that move did. Imprison, like, I never actually read what it's supposed to do. I just know it's useless. <clears throat> she has, like, all psychic types. Well, Natsu's not as, like, bulky as uh, Luna, so we'll just swap in Austin to kill it not to. And we'll just spam one. Oh, or it's gonna spam confusion. Okay, we did more damage with water gun. How much damage is that doing to us? Too much? Alright, listen, I ain't dealing with crits today. I ain't dealing with these crits today. I already know it's gonna get a crit and I'm gonna die. Oh, Nightshade. It's only gonna do 14 damage. We are faster, aren't we? No. But there's no way Nightshade can actually, like, yeah. Okay. The last Pokemon's probably gonna be a Psychic type. Yeah, it's a Rolds. Um, in that case, we'll just use Gabe to finish it off. But we are going to get Austin to evolve today. And that's not going to be the end of the episode. The end of the episode will be probably after that. Trace. Scrappy. Whatever. Just die. There we go. Also has like no defense, so it died really easily. Okay, we didn't lose any Pokemon that time. Oh, man. I'm not trying to lose any more. That's all I can do from that. Actually, how much? I should probably go back and buy more healing items. It would probably be smart at this point. Just because, like, we lost Eli, and uh, I don't really trust my RNG from this point forward because of that battle. So, it's best that we get some healing items and stay fresh and stuff. Um. I don't think we need super potions necessarily right now. A whole lot. Let's go with like six of these. Ah, you know, we'll buy like a few super potions. We'll buy like five. Okay, there we go. Alright. Alright. No, turn on the bike. That guy finally letting us through. Because if you couldn't... Uh, that old man, if you didn't complete all that stuff, he wouldn't have let you through, so... Alright. So next up, there's this kid. Yep. There's this kid standing up on the slide. Hyper Beam! He's hitting me with that Hyper Beam. That's not very nice. He's got three Pokemon. Wow. He's got a Mudkip. I've got an Austin. Okay, Mold Breaker, what the hell? Well, Mudkip is a water type, so Water Gun's not really gonna do a whole lot. Oh, but he's got Mud Slap. Critical hit. 
We're just gonna keep spamming tackle. Oh my god, I'm just gonna get... He's gonna continue lowering my accuracy. There we go. There we go, a crit. Nice. And level 17, so Austin is gonna level up after this battle. Ooh, Razor Shell. Forget. We'll forget Focus Energy. I never use Focus Energy, so. Yeah, we'll just forget Focus Energy. Shell Ops. Alright, well, Austin has his accuracy lowered, so I don't want. You know. I don't want Austin to, like, miss a bunch of times. So, we'll just go into Gabe. Bite. Just bite this thing a lot. Hopefully it flinches every time. Yeah, nice. All right. Sick. And now Gabe's going to be level 18. Very nice. I believe Gabe evolves again at level 36 or 34. Psyduck, huh? Do we want to stay in with Gabe? Well, Psyduck's probably going to have confusion. Oh, well. Let's just hope Psyduck doesn't have confusion. I really hope it doesn't, but since this is Volt White, yeah, this could be rough. Okay. It's got Tail Whip. Alright. It's faster than us as well. That's really interesting. I think Austin is minus speed, so I guess that would make sense. And a crit! I was gonna say thank you, crit gods, but oh my goodness. You would do that. You would do that. I didn't even know it had disabled. Ha! But you can't put me to sleep. Alright, well. I lived on 1 HP even after a crit. That's just like me. Alright, and Austin's now evolving, so. That's good. That's good. Now we're getting a do what? <sighs> One of my favorite middle evolutions. Not usually a fan of middle evolutions, but yeah. Ooh, karate chop. Ah, uh, yeah. We're gonna forget. God dang tackle. Could have gotten rid of water gun, but... Mm. Nice, okay. So now we're going to challenge these little kids. Trainer, I want to play with you. You were challenged by preschooler Wendy. Sent out Totodile. I guess they just have a bunch of starters. Not sure why they're all the water starters, but... It is what it is. Now we have Karate Chop. Oh yeah, that feels good. Austin's got Karate Chop. He's got Razor Shell. Man. Oh, this Karate Chop's actually going to be super helpful for the second gym. I'm going to want to keep Austin alive for the second gym. And now that I said that he's going to be an important goal for the second gym, he's probably going to die. Just how it goes. It just be like that. Hip up, eh? And Austin should get another level up after this, and that would catch him up to Gabe. Ooh, nice. Brian. Alright. Ah. Uh, yes. Alright, killed Pip Plop. Nice. Level 18. That's good, that's good. Alright. Yeah, it's going to be really hard leveling up um, Gabe and Jess. Actually, real quick. I don't need to, but I'm going to heal. Don't need to, but I'm going to heal. Just because. Alright. Hey, trainer, battle with me. Have a battle with me. Fine, I'll have a battle with this preschooler. Why do they all have, like, water? Just the water starters. It's so weird. Maybe it's based on the starter you chose. Maybe. 
That would make a lot of sense to me. Oh my god. That wasn't even a crit. Yo, even though you just rose your defense, Squirtle, this Karate Chop should still kill. Yeah. Well, Oshawott. Look at that, Austin. It's what you were just a few minutes ago. Actually, I think after this battle, looking at the time, after this battle, I'm just gonna end off the video. Right. Okay. I will probably not grind off camera. Not for a little bit, at least. Okay, we're gonna save the game there. We lost one Pokemon today. We lost Eli. So, it is what it is. You know, it happens. I got mad, but you know what? I'm past it. Because it happens. So, anyways, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Actually, before I uh, end off, you'll notice that this video doesn't have any edits or anything. There's no, you know, there's no edit. No, no edits. No like layout. I was, I gonna add a layout, but um, uh, some stuff came up, so prevented me from not doing that. Same with the edits. Um some stuff came up so not able to do that um so anyways guys thank you all so much for watching i really hope you enjoyed the video if you did you should smash that like button and if you're new to the channel you should hit the subscribe button like right uh right down there yeah right down there I had to make sure i had that right and while you're while you're at it you might as well hit the bell icon as well so you get notified or yeah some get notified of when I upload videos like this. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.